Welcome back to the House of Hughes. If you love Beckham and you think that his little laugh is the cutest thing in the entire world, then you're gonna wanna stay tuned for today's video because this basically whole video is my little man being so freaking cute and scrumptious. I got the most adorable footage of him with his grandpa yesterday. I cannot wait to show you guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and insert that for you right here. Oh my goodness, look who came to visit. Whoa, Bubba. <laughs> Beckham was so excited when Grandpa was here when he woke up from his nap. <laughs> Good job, Baba. Yeah, you love Grandpa. So, fun fact I know I've talked about this before, but my dad literally came to the NICU every single day that Beckham was in the NICU for four and a half months. Yeah, huh? You have a pretty special bond, huh, Bubba? He's gonna give Grandpa hugs. Yeah. He's gonna give Grandpa love. Oh, good job, Bubba. That's such a sweet oh. hug. You give him Grandpa loves. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> you gonna give Grandpa love. Oh, that's so oh. cute, baby. Oh. I was just crawling towards Grandpa, and Grandpa, tell me what you just told me. Oh, this little boy, hey, hey. He's learned to never drag his G2 against the carpet. He always, see, he always hangs that left side up in the air. I don't think I've ever really noticed that, but you're right. He literally always lifts this part yeah. of his belly off. Come here. You come to Grandpa. You going to oh, Grandpa? You come to Grandpa. Oh, you come to Grandpa. You gonna come to Grandpa? Huh? Good job, Baba. Oh. <laughs> oh. You want to see Grandpa? Yeah. Good job, Baba. Hey, hey, what are you doing? Hey. Wow. Oh, no. Beckham loves being on his belly. It's so cute. Can you hear that buzzer? Wow. He has exceptional hearing. He does. You do, huh, Baba? Yeah. He also is so sensitive to sound in terms of like everything makes him laugh, which is so fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you love big noises, huh? Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no. No. Where are you going, Bubba? Ah! <laughs> get up here. You're gonna get up here with Grandpa. Ready? Oh, no. Where are you going? Where are you going? Hey. Where do you want to go? Oh no. No! No! Ah! <laughs> you big boy. Good job, Baba. He's come like, excuse me, I'd like to come back. Come on, get up here. Reach for Grandpa. Ah! Good job, baby. <laughs> what are you doing? You getting Grandpa? <laughs> yeah, say good thing I haven't eaten yet. Ah. Can you say guh? Oh no! Ah. <laughs> yeah, you dilly boy. You come see Grandpa. You gonna come see Grandpa? Come here. <laughs> All right, Grandpa has to go bye bye. So he's giving Beckham all the loves. Good job. Oh, those hugs are so precious. Say bye bye, Grandpa. I love you. Go say bye bye to Grandpa. Bye bye, Grandpa. Bye bye. How freaking cute was that? Beckham always gets so excited when grandpa comes over to visit. My parents only live 10 minutes from us, so they come over a lot and say hi to the kids, which is so cute. So Beckham was so excited because grandpa got him up from his nap and he loves playing on my dad's belly and just being like eye to eye with him. It's the cutest little thing in the world. And now it's a weekend, so we have Mr. Hunter Hughes home and it's actually our last Saturday with Hunter before his season starts, so we're gonna soak up all of this time. And Beckham was telling me that he wants to play on daddy's shoulders. Oh, let me do my hair, Beckham. Let's look spicy. 
<laughs> oh, right, let's go. there we go. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> All right, let's show them. Let's show them some strength. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Without taking an eyeball. <laughs> oh, I forgot to tell Holy you, babe. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was stretching with him, or not stretching, balancing with him the other day. He bit my leg. You can't bite me. You can't bite. He's so cute. Okay. Let's go to the left. If you bite me one more time. Okay. <laughs> He's in a playful mood. He's yeah. so cute. You don't have to be therapy. We can play sometimes. What about straight back? What about straight back? <laughs> you are so tough. Why, hello. Is someone Wait, sad they're not getting <laughs> attention? <gasps> Look, Daddy made you a sandwich. Come here. Did Daddy make you a sandwich? Blakely's favorite food is a sandwich lately. There is quite a lot to it. There's bread that you have to butter and then cheese that you have to put on the bread. It's so a wild it's, time. it does take quite a while. Oh my word, Hunter, that looks so good. <laughs> <laughs> Quick little backstory on how the sandwich was made. I always make my cheeseburgers, and you guys have seen me make that a million times. I use 96.4 lean ground beef, fetch up, Velveeta cheese, and a low calorie bun, just because it's super high protein, low calorie, and right now in my cycle of life, that's important to me. So Blakely sat down every single time I made these burgers. And I don't share these cheeseburgers with anybody in the world. But they're completely impossible to not share them with her. I mean, she looks at me and I said no the first time. I was like, oh no, these are for daddy. Starts crying. So anyway, <laughs> we ate our cheeseburgers together moving forward. And then I thought to myself, I really don't want to share these cheeseburgers. So it was, <laughs> so it was always bigger. So I would always make an extra sandwich on the side and I just took the patty out because she liked it more. And that's how these uh, sandwiches were made. So she always asked dad to make them and not mom. And I insist mom never does because it's kind of something that her and I share. Yeah, it's your thing. Yeah, and the way she thing. says sandwich, I wish I could get her to say it on camera. Here, let's Wait, try. Do you want a sandwich? Blakely, can you say sandwich? Sandwich! Yes. Oh. She's pretty excited. Mom, we need ketchup. Do you need help? That was a close call. Bubba, what is that? You haven't. <gasps> Wait a darn minute. He loves it, babe. <laughs> this is why we love it when dad's home. I have never done this with him before, so if he cries or gets upset, we'll just immediately stop, of course. Okay, thumbs up. You ready? One, two, three! Whoa! Whoa! He's tasting the air because he feels wind on his face when he's going really fast. Oh my goodness. Whoa. You guys, look at how he's Whoa. sitting in there. Hi, baby. Ready, set, whee. This is a really sturdy basket, by the way. It would not break. <laughs> Whoa, is this fun? <laughs> Whoa, baby! Is that fun? He's so cute. He wants to bite the side of it. He's trying to 100%. lean forward to bite that. Good Is that job. Fun? Do you want to do more? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Good job! Oh, sorry, that was kind of far away. Mommy will get it. Come here, Baba. Back. He 
He's been like fascinated with the door. Is that the outside? <laughs> bye bye. Here's the ball. <gasps> Whoa, good catch. Good catch, Bubba. Can you pass it back to Mama? Good job. Ready? <gasps> good job. Good baby. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job, wow. Okay, do you guys hear that? Pounding noise, our ice maker is broken, which is devastating. So I've got my handyman trying to fix it. Fun little fact, Hunter is amazing at so many things, but being a handyman is not one of them, so we definitely need to hire someone. Uh, excuse me, I fixed everything. Everything. What? How dare you? What have you fixed? In are our you kidding me? <laughs> okay, we, we are putting our relationship on hold for a second. No, emotionally, solved. Hunter fixes all my problems 100%. But physically, you feel like you're a handyman? Like oh, no, I wouldn't say like, I couldn't like repair anything with wood, but I can like troubleshoot anything. Does that make sense? So for example, Rachel's, um, Com Rachel has like technical issues all the time with her phone, <laughs> with the computer, with the television. Oh, you um, did fix my phone that one I've, time. Uh, Wait, I am so mind blown right TV. now. By my life. I fixed the TV. You did, remember? I had to unplug it. No, I know. And you said that's not gonna work. And I said yes, it is. And then I did it. In seven years, Rachel had the idea to um, <laughs> unplug and unplug plug the, the TV. TV. So what we're getting at is I'm really the handyman in this relationship. I'm in my diet do era. Okay, my hair is looking extra fluffy because I just got out of the shower and Hunter and I are going on date night tonight. So I blew my hair out. I got my new Dyson in and it's the best. I'm obsessed with it. But that is besides the point. I hope that you guys loved watching Beckham laugh today. He's so flipping cute. Kate is actually headed over to change out his G-tube. It's so nice that she can do it and she's 100% comfortable with it. Hunter and I can do it, but it is really nice to have Kate who's so close. So of course, if she is willing and able to do it, we prefer that that be the case. So she is coming over to change out his G-tube because you guys know that Beckham had strep throat. Well, strep throat actually starts in your throat, but it can infect the entire GI tract. So his pediatrician let us know that when Beckham is fully recovered to go ahead and just switch out the G-tube so that it's clean and sterile. So that is what we're going to be doing. That's why all of the supplies is out on the counter. So we're gonna go ahead and let Beckham finish taking his nap and then Kate will be here to switch out that G-tube. And both of the kids are doing amazing. So that is a quick little update. Everyone is finally healthy in this house, thank goodness. It's kind of a crazy week. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm gonna go ahead and close out this vlog here. And of course, before closing out, I want to remind you to be brave like Beckham. And we will catch you in our next vlog. Bye.